Kitty, one teacher, and one Akiko. Okay, let's try now. If it's okay. All right, there you go. Finally. Okay, so again, Akiko, it's answer the activity. So number one here is message. How about number two? <clears throat> Okay, finished? Yes. yes. All right, so now let's check if you got the correct answers now. So the next one is internet, correct? Email, correct? Text, correct? Video, correct? Website, correct? And photos is also correct. Very good, Akiko. One, two, three, four, five, six points for you. Okay, so now let's move on to the next um, activity. Oh, where is it? Wait a minute. What is this? What is this? I cannot see it. Okay, here you go. Oh, you have some lots of sweets there. Yes. <laughs> you have some candies, ice cream, and donut. Okay, so now, Kiko, let's begin our activity for tonight. <clears throat> Okay, so now, Kiko, let's listen to part number one. Listen and draw a line. There is one example. Part one. Look at part one. Look at the picture. Listen and look. There is one example. Where's Jane? She's in the water. Is she swimming? Yes, that's right. She swims very well. Yes, she does. Can you see the line? This is an example. Now you listen and draw lines. One. Which one is Jill? She's a baby. She's sitting under a chair. Is she having a drink? No, that's not Jill. Jill is under the chair. Oh, right. What's she doing under the chair? She's playing with something. It's a kind of toy, I think. Two. I'm looking for Daisy. Daisy? She's got long hair. But there are three girls with long hair. Daisy's hair is blonde. 
Oh, I can see her. She's swimming in the sea. No, no, that's Jane. Is Daisy sitting by the sea? Yes, that's right. Three. Where's Paul? He's sailing. Sorry? <laughs> Paul's sailing. He's in the boat. Can't you see him? There are two boys in the boat. Yes, Paul has curly hair. Is he standing or sitting? He's standing. OK, I can see him. <laughs> Four. Has Paul got a brother? Yes. His name's John. Is John in the boat with Paul? No. John's only a baby. Oh, I can see him. He's in the chair. That's right. He's having a drink. Five. Where's Sally? She's sitting on the beach. She has long hair. What colour hair? Is it blonde? No, no, it's brown. What's she doing? She's sitting next to the chair. She's with the babies. Oh, yes, I can see her. Now listen to part one again. One. Which one is Jill? She's a baby. She's sitting under a chair. Is she having a drink? No, that's not Jill. Jill is under the chair. Oh, right. What's she doing under the chair? She's playing with something. It's a kind of toy, I think. Two. I'm looking... Okay, what, what happened? Where, well, are you finished answering? Not yet? No, no. Okay, let's, let's listen one more time. Part one. Look at part one. Look at the picture. <laughs> listen and look. There is one example. Where's Jane? She's in the water. Is she swimming? Yes, that's right. She swims very well. Yes, she does. Can you see the line? This is an example. Now you listen and draw lines. One. Which one is Jill? She's a baby. She's sitting under a chair. Is she having a drink? No, that's not Jill. Jill is under the chair. Oh, right. What's she doing under the chair? She's playing with something. It's a kind of toy, I think. Two. I'm looking for Daisy. Daisy? She's got long hair. But there are three girls with long hair. Daisy's hair is blonde. Oh, I can see her. She's swimming in the sea. No, no, that's Jane. Is Daisy sitting by the sea? Yes, that's right. Three. Where's Paul? He's sailing. Sorry? <laughs> Paul's sailing. He's in the boat. Can't you see him? There are two <laughs> boys in the boat. Yes, Paul has curly hair. Is he standing or sitting? He's standing. OK, I can see him. Four. Has Paul got a brother? Yes. His name's John. Is John in the boat with Paul? No. John's only a baby. Oh, I can see him. He's in the chair. That's right. He's having a drink. Five. Where's Sally? She's sitting on the beach. She has long hair. What colour hair? Is it blonde? No, no, it's brown. What's she doing? She's sitting next to the chair. She's with the babies. Oh, yes, I can see her. Now listen to part one again. Okay. One. 
So, let's check your answers. Number one, can you read it, please, Akiko? Because teacher has no voice. <laughs> Jewel and the baby sitting under the chair, playing with toy. toy. Yes, yeah, Jewel. And blonde hair, go sitting by the sea. Correct. Paul and the curly and hair boy standing in the boat. The boat. John, John and the baby is sitting in the chair having a drink. A drink. Sally and the brown, and the brown hair girl sitting with the babies. Okay, so it means you got all the answers. Correct. Okay, that is a total of five points, Akiko. Very good. Okay, now let's move on to the next one. So this is part number two. Listen and try. There is one example. So here, Akiko, just like our um, activities before, you just have to listen and write the information that you will hear on the line, okay? Okay. So let's start now. <laughs> part two. Listen and look. There is one example. What are you reading, Jim? It's a school book. What's the name of the book? The Red River. Can you see the answer? Now you listen and write. 1. Do you like reading, Jim? It's OK, but I like sports better. Which sports do you like? Tennis. Basketball and swimming. Two. Where do you swim? At my school. Where do you go to school? I go to Long Road School. Is that L O N G? Yes, that's right. Three. Do you have a lot of friends at school? Yes. Who's your best friend? John Bird. How do you write that? B I R D. Four. How old is he? He's eleven, like me. Eleven? That's right. Five. Does he like a lot of sports like you? No, he only likes soccer. Now listen to part two again. <laughs> One. Okay, so now let's check if you got the correct answer, Sakiko. So this is about Jim. The name of the book is The Red River. Favorite sport is tennis, basketball, and swimming, correct? School is long, road school. Best friend's name is John Bird. Best friend, how old? It's 11 years old. And the best friend's favorite sport is soccer. Oh, why did you spell soccer like? You have to put letter K, but it must be two C's. Okay, but I will give it a point to you. Uh, next time, okay, it not, it's not C and K, okay? It's double C. Okay, next one, Akiko. Let's move on to part number three. What did Anna do last week? Listen and draw a line from the day to the correct picture. There is one example. Part three. <laughs> Look at the pictures. What did Anna do last week? Listen and look. There is one example. Hello, Anna. Hello, Grandpa. What did you do last week? Tell me. Um. 
On Saturday, I went for a long walk by the river. With your mum and dad? Yes. Can you see the line from the word Saturday? On Saturday, Anna went for a walk with her parents. Now you listen and draw lines. One. What did you do on Sunday? Nothing. You mean you were at home? Yes, at home in the garden. Well, the weather was nice. Yes, it was. We sat and read books. Two. But I had a great evening on Thursday. Sorry, I mean Wednesday. What did you do? I went to my friend's birthday party. Was it in the garden? No, in her living room. There were lots of people there. Three. And what about Tuesday afternoon? I was at school on Tuesday, Grandpa. What did you do? We did some singing in the music room. I enjoyed that. Hmm. I like singing too. Four. What did you do on Monday after school? Um, I helped the teacher. Did you? Yes. We put some pictures up on the wall. Did you draw the pictures? All the children in my class did. <laughs> Five. And what did you do on Friday? Did you go down to the river again? Not that day. Two of my friends came to see me at my house. And what did you do? We listened to music and danced a lot. And you enjoyed that? Oh yes. Now listen to part three again. Okay, let's check now. One. So you're finished. Okay, Monday is correct. Tuesday correct also. Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday is correct. Okay, very good, Akiko. Five, oh, five points for you. All right, next one, Akiko. So this is um, part number four. So listen and tick the box. There is one example. Part four. Look at the pictures. Listen and look. There is one example. Which boy is Peter? Who do you sit next to at school, Jim? Peter. Which one is Peter? He's thin and he's got brown hair. Does he wear glasses? No, he doesn't. Is he thin with brown hair? Yes, that's right. He's thin with short brown hair. Can you see the tick? Now you listen and tick the box. One. Which book is Fred reading? What's that book you're reading, Fred? It's a story book. Is it a school book? No, it isn't. I only read it at home. What's it about? Is it about the moon? No, it's about stars. Two. What did Paul buy? Did you go shopping this afternoon, Paul? Yes, I did. I wanted a computer game. Did you buy it? No, I didn't. I bought some new shoes. What colour? Brown. <laughs> oh, and I bought a jacket. A black one. Shoes and a jacket. Great! <laughs> okay, so number one, Akiko, let's check. Which book is Fred reading? Letter A is correct. Two, what did Paul buy? 
Letter B is also correct. Okay, now let's go on to the next page. Three. What TV programs does Jim like? What TV programs do you like, Jim? I like sports programs. Do you like football? No, I don't. What about basketball? Yes, I like basketball and tennis. What about baseball? No, I don't like baseball. Four. What would Sally like to eat? Are you hungry, Sally? Yes, I am. Can we buy something to eat? What would you like? I'd like some French fries and an orange juice. French fries and an orange juice. And can I have some ice cream? No, it's a cold day. Let's have some soup. Oh, no, not soup. I want ice cream. OK, OK, you can have ice cream. French fries, orange juice and ice cream. Five. What does Jill want to do today? <laughs> what do you want to do today, Jill? I'd like to watch TV. Wouldn't you like to go to the cinema? Can we go on Saturday? I can't go with you on Saturday. That's OK. Ben can go with me. So, it's TV today, the cinema on Saturday. That's right. And your homework? I did it this morning. Now listen to part four again. One. Which book is Fred reading? Okay, so let's check now number three. What TV program does Jim like? Letter A is correct for what would Sally like to eat? Letter B is correct. And last one, what does Jill want to do today? Letter B is also correct. Very good, Akiko. <clears throat> okay, next one. So this is the last part. So you must listen to this one and color the picture. Part five. Look at the picture. Listen and look. There is one example. Look, can you see the plane? I can see two planes. That's right. There are two planes. Can you see the big plane? Yes, I can see it now. Can you colour it red? Colour the big plane red. That's right. Can you see the red plane? This is an example. Now you listen and colour and draw. One. OK, now, can you see the windows on the boat? Yes, there are four windows. Can you see the round windows? Yes, I can see them. Good. Can I colour them yellow? No, colour them blue. Two. Good. Now, can you find the bird? Which bird? What do you mean? Well, there are two birds. One is flying, one is sitting on the water. Oh, yes. I didn't see the bird in the sky. Can you colour the bird on the water yellow? OK, we can colour the bird on the water yellow. Yellow is a good colour for a bird. Three. Do you want to draw something? Yes. Can I draw another window? <laughs> we have a lot of windows. Do you want to draw something different? OK. Draw a cloud. Where? Above the helicopter. OK. A cloud above the helicopter.
Four. Can you see the pirates? I can see two pirates. That's right. There are two pirates in the picture. Can I colour something? What do you want to colour? I want to colour the fat pirate's jacket. <laughs> what colour? Um, black, I think. That's good. Colour the fat pirate's jacket black. <coughs> Fine. Do you want to colour the thin pirate's jacket? No, I want to draw something on his hat. <laughs> what do you want to draw? A fish. A fish? Why? I don't know. I like fish. Well, OK. Draw a fish on the thin pirate's hat. OK. What colour? Um, colour the fish green. Green. That's good. I like green. Now listen to part five again. One. OK, now, can you see the windows on the boat? Yes, there are four windows. OK, are you finished? Yes. All right, let's see. So number one, color the round windows of the boat blue. That's correct. Two, color the bird on the water yellow. Correct. Three, draw a cloud above the helicopter. Uh, you, above the helicopter. Okay, you just draw it under the helicopter. Okay, that's wrong. Four, color the jacket of the fat pirate black. Okay, and five, draw a green fish on the hat of the thin pirate. Okay, very good, Akiko. So four points here. Okay, so now let's go on to the next activity. Wait for me. <laughs> okay, here you go. Okay, wait a minute, 